this engine uh, hasn't run and people have tried to get it to go. So it, it was taken apart and uh, loosely put back together before I had bought it. Whenever, uh, whenever this, this part is loose, you know that there might be an issue or two that has to be addressed. So I'm going to pull the head off of it and then prop the cylinder too, and we will see what's in there. Try and get some of the weight off of it. Pepper can muffler. I checked for pepper, but it wasn't included. So I, I guess in this model, you, you got to buy your own pepper. I love the exposed rockers. I've seen old ship engines that had exposed rockers and they just go along rhythmically. It's nice to watch. You have to lubricate them, of course, uh, because there's no automatic lubrication, but they just sit there and they do their thing. It's funny working on an engine where everything's just hand tight. Usually uh, you're busting your knuckles, trying to get things that are loose, but everything is just, uh, just coming apart by hand. So why not? I'll take that as a, a victory. Here's the injector. The injector tip looks maybe a little rusted. I don't know. We'll have to see. Maiko, it's a Indian copy of Bosch. I think I'll take this high pressure line off. And come on. <laughs> All right, well. Really, it's all hand tight, hand tight. Ooh, that stuff's a little loose. Well, let's see if this comes up. Oh boy. Oh, okay. 